So I'm making boxes these days. I found this at the local hardware store. They sell it as luxury kindling for starting fires, but um, it's also a uniform that that I, f I find it to be a good building material for small projects. So um, I needed some boxes and now it's just it's taken over. I find it quite funny to make these boxes. So I'm just making a bunch of them um, while I have some of these sticks. And um, I thought I'd show you how today. So there it is. Pretty simple box, almost. Well, mainly because all of them can be glued together, being full size, except for the the herringbone pattern on the lid. But I thought it'd be nice with a little something different for the lid, even though this Japanese locking mechanism um, sort of covers it, but. I think it looks pretty nice, even though um, and obviously you can sand it down or paint it or give it some oil, but um, it works just like this anyway, um, just as well. Um, I kind of like the little the wedge here to just stick out a little when it's when it's locked because it's easier to pull it than if it's in here and stuck so then you have to really press with the tip of your finger and it might hurt but when it sticks out just a little just push it open the lid and then you're in I like this that the only thing I need is the sticks and some glue. No screws, no nails, no nothing. So, simple box made of so-called kindling. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you next time.